got to know the, the young man a little bit, but also from a scouting standpoint, you were you, you uh, analyzed him over the years at Ohio State and, and coming into the league with the Washington Commanders and then going to the Pittsburgh Steelers. Obviously, it's a terrible tragedy. And and what what are your thoughts on that? Also on the player because you did chronicle his career very closely. Well, you know, Dan, uh, I hate any time anybody is killed or anybody dies. Uh, but he was a guy that was living to be dead, so to speak. Uh, you know, they told him, don't under any circumstances leave school early. You just, you just don't have the work habits, you don't have this, you don't have that. What do you do? Left school early. Uh, I always can remember this. Uh, we invited players to the draft, and he was one of the players we invited to the draft. And uh, we were told, no, uh, uh, we're, uh, we're going to have our own party. His own party was uh, a party at the bowling alley, charging him 50 bucks to get into the bowling alley for his party. Uh, it was always something, you know, it, it's, it's one of those things. Uh, I'm never offside, but they keep calling me for offside. Is what it is. So, you know, it, it's a tragic thing. Anytime anybody dies, it's tragic. Uh, and especially when you're 24 years old and you got to hold your whole life ahead of you. Uh, but, uh, you know, maybe if he'd have stayed in school a year, uh, he wouldn't do silly things. I mean, I don't know when you're jogging on the highway, uh, you know, on a road like that, that leaves it open because I'll tell you, it's so. Uh, Guy has two drinks and he's just a little bit to, to the right side of the road and, and gets hit and killed. That's easy to happen. Yeah, uh, we, I want to just uh, share this. This is a statement that